Welcome back to Action News on this cold, snowy day. And I want to thank all the Action News viewers who sent me photos on my Facebook, my Twitter accounts. I want to share this one from Katie in Manahawken, where they had about a foot of snow, but the drifts, two to three feet. So she opened up her door, and the snow was all the way up to the handle of the door. That just shows the power of the wind and that blowing snow. Now, Storm Tracker 6 Live double scan showing it's pretty much out of here. We have two pockets of some snow showers right now. One one across the Lehigh Valley east and right now it's moved out of Quakertown. It's heading towards Milford. It's light. It really shouldn't drop much accumulation at all. And there's one little shower right now moving across South Jersey, crossing Route 55, Glassboro and Elmer and Hamilton. And that's really the last of it. The storm continues to wind up off the coast of New England, but behind it we have some real vicious winds. Currently, wind gusts in Philadelphia 35 miles per hour, Atlantic City Airport 41. They had blizzard conditions in Atlantic City today, Wilmington 44 and the Poconos wind gusts right now 40 degrees. So the wind chills are starting to drop. They're not that bad right now. Feels like 11 in Philadelphia. We can handle that eight in Millville, seven in Reading, but the wind chills will really drop overnight and stay very low for the next two days. Satellite and radar showing here's the center of the storm. It's off the coast of New England, continuing to deepen to strengthen as it moves away from us, and that will help funnel in that very cold air. So tonight clearing skies overnight low nine in Philadelphia, six in Allentown, nine in Wilmington, 13 in Cape May. But we have the winds all night long. Winds sustained generally out of the west northwest about 20 to 25 miles per hour. But those wind gusts 30 to 40 miles per hour. So these wind chills, you look at this, you don't want to go outside tonight at 10 o'clock, two below in Philadelphia, six below in Allentown. But look at tomorrow morning as you head to work. 11 below in Philadelphia. This is like Siberia kind of weather. 16 below in Allentown, 14 below in Lakehurst and the Poconos, all the way down to 30 below zero. And even through the afternoon, wind chills will remain below zero. So this is dangerous cold. So the five day at five showing tomorrow that dangerous wind chills. The afternoon high 17 wind chills below zero. Saturday, the air temperature drops even more 15 degrees. And look at that low for Sunday morning, the coldest day in Philadelphia in 24 years, Sunday 19 on Monday 35, but an icy mix in the afternoon and we clear out on Tuesday with a high of 42. We'll talk more about Monday coming up in the seven day forecast. Guys. Absolutely.